you must have seen a container either on road or on a ship. But do you know how it got there? Today, we are going to explore the fascinating world of container shipping and the incredible process of loading or unloading container cargo from a container ship at super fast speeds. Let's get started. There are huge container vessels which sail at slow speeds for efficiency and economic reasons, making international trade possible on such a large scale. A container ship is a slow moving mode of transport, but when it comes to port for cargo loading or unloading, the average stay of a mid-size container ship is less than a day. The Sultanate ports in Oman averaged only 12 and a half hours, including all entry, exit, loading and unloading operations for handling shipping containers. Depending upon the port's efficiency and their infrastructure, the largest container ship with a massive 24,000 TEU capacity can be loaded or unloaded in one day or two. This is good for the shipping company operating the container ships, as it has to pay for every hour of stay to the port authorities. That is why time to load or discharge the container matters a lot. The process of loading or discharging containers onto a container ship is called container cargo operation. The containers are loaded onto the ship using large cranes, which can move containers at incredible speeds. However, it is not the sole reason why container ships are loaded or unloaded so fast. The cargo container handling efficiency is a result of multiple factors and coordination of three different areas the ship, the jetty, and the container stack and beyond. The ship plays a vital role and the ship staff including the ship planner and chief officer of the ship plan the storage of the container as per their destination and weight. The container which is to be unloaded in the next port should be easily accessible to save time for the crane to reach it. Similarly, containers with heavy weight should not be stored on top to avoid stress on the containers below. If the container carries hazardous cargo, it should be stored in a place which is reachable. This ensures that there is no mishaps and that the ship operation is not disrupted to maintain the ETA of the ship. For jetty staff, there are crane operators, truck operators and stevedoers. It is important that stevedoers know which container to unlock or lock if it is loaded. The truck operator either takes the unloaded container to the right container depot or station or bring the container from the port container stack to the right ships where it is to be loaded. The container depot crane operator then picks up the container from the truck and load it into the ship or unload it from the ship to the truck. Hence, he or she should know which container to lift. Container gantry is cranes that are mounted on rails on the dock side and can span the entire width of the ship. The cranes are operated by highly skilled crane operators who use a variety of tools to ensure that the containers are loaded safely and efficiently. These tools include special spreaders that attach to the containers and allow them to be lifted and moved into position. Once the container is attached to the spreader, the crane lifts the container and moves it into position on the ship. The crane can move the container horizontally and vertically and even rotate it if needed. Once the container is in position, it is locked into place using special twist lock mechanisms. These mechanisms ensure that the container stays securely in place during rough seas and prevents them from shifting or falling over. The process of loading containers onto a container ship is incredibly efficient. In fact, the fastest loading times can see up to 40 containers being loaded onto a ship in a single hour. Once the container reaches the port container depot, then it is transported to its destination either by small ship, barges, rail or truck. Usually from the port, 
trucks and rails are used to transport the container to its destination. The shipper should make sure all paperwork is in order so that the port customs does not have any issue with the load. The key to loading containers quickly is efficiency and planning. Container ports have advanced systems in place that allow them to track the movement of containers, plan for their arrival and optimize the loading process. We hope that you now know how the containers are loaded or unloaded from ships efficiently. Please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for regular updates.